I'm going to keep it all the way 100, bro, because I ain't depending on nobody to do nothing for me, bro. Starlito's not obligated to do nothing with me. Buck is not obligated to do nothing with me. Yeah. So with that being said, I'm going to go out here and create it for myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, respectfully. I'm going to yeah. go out here and create it. I'm going to go out here and create it for, you know what I'm saying, the people that are coming up with me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I didn't mean, when I said myself, I didn't mean that in, like, a selfish way. But I'm Fact. saying, like, if, 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 if they're, if, if we're not doing a the record, then I, what, what am I going to do? Stop. Yeah. If you are live, subscribe. Uh, it's always uh, a compliment for my 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 guests and the people that subscribing and the people that's watching. Uh, I think I've been having pretty good guests. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think I think it's been interesting, and I think my platform is not about somebody that ain't doing nothing. Everybody that come here is doing something, and I wanna I wanna shout out to uh, Starlito and the concert last night and uh bringing all the old school people out and the, the legends and the ogs but um you know i'm you know i'm always honest i have a problem with you know what i'm saying with that like i didn't see none of the i didn't see none of the guys like the breeze and the lotuses and the sweet poisons and i think i think we are so focused on the older generation that we don't even foresee the people that's coming behind. You know what I'm saying? And so, um, not a, to offend anybody, anything, but uh, like, yeah, it's cool to come together for one night. Everybody came together for one night. It was all good. Buck came out. Hi, ah, Kwani, everybody. But uh, what are we gonna do after that? Was it just was it just for that one night, or is this something that we trying to? bring the people together but i just want to say like if you're gonna bring the people together like it starts with the younger generation and not saying i always uh talk about the people that's 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 been in the game and this has wrapped in not that don't stop doing music but it's it's so many people that's coming behind you guys that i don't feel like that you're embracing you know what i'm saying that's just yeah. that's just my own like i said y'all know i'm gonna keep it honest i don't feel like y'all embracing the younger community like you should and this is the thing, even with the media situation, like, you know, if you're a live subscribe, it's the media. I'm the media for Nashville. Like, that ain't that ain't trying to uh, drag my coattail. But the podcast is to tell you I'm the podcast to go to. You know what I'm saying? You feel and me? so even with, 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 with that star, little like, invite us. Let us be a part. If you're doing something with Nashville feels and all that, and you wonder, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm on stage. I'm, I'm doing it. But... Also, you're going to have to start, yo, you guys are going to have to start um, inviting us to y'all events to work. Uh, Kwani, anybody know I'm not just a fan. You know what I'm saying? I'm a person that's coming trying to do some business, and we're, try all, we're all trying to get our platforms off the ground, and we need you guys on the higher up to help us because guess what? If you don't, when we get there, not saying that you might need us, we don't. Everybody, we don't need nobody. Everybody don't need nobody but God. You know what I'm saying? But when we get there, it's like, okay, you didn't help. Now you want to work. You know what I mean? And so um, I got a guest today. And shout out to Lotus. What's happening? What's up, man? How you I'm doing? I'm sorry for the rant. Hey. I just had to go on that that little hey. rant. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, you, you was just speaking your truth, man. I saw you on the uh, South Cypher. Yep. And you were speaking on that everybody always talking about let's work. And then the work never gets done. Absolutely. Was that, was that towards a certain person or towards a certain community? Or what was that about? Because I can feel what you're saying. Um, I was just speaking in general, man. Just speaking in general. You know, I've I've gotten a, oh, yeah, bro, I see you. Uh, we going to work. And, you know, I mean, that's happened to me before. So I was speaking from personal experience. But, I mean, that's just, that's just what it was. You know, I, 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 that wasn't, I, didn't, I didn't say that with any ill intent. But I mean, yeah, that's just that's just honestly how I feel, you know. All I get is we gonna work, and so I see you. That's on repeat, you know. Facts, facts. So, so yeah. even, even even when we're talking about when we're dealing with uh, the Nashville hip hop community, which yeah. I love, uh, I'm a big fan of. But when we're talking about like we, I was just talking about the Star Show. Like I didn't see none of y'all. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Shout right. shout out to Q. Shout out to Buck. I saw them. You know what I'm saying? Them, and shout out to all those guys. Big shout out and to all them. those guys. No, I'm honest. They. You know, they, they know I'm going to speak my truth, but... Absolutely. Where is the disconnect from the younger artists coming in being a part of what they got going on that you just think? Man, I, you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy, B, bro? I honestly, 
I honestly don't know. Because, I mean, the younger generation, I feel like people support each other. You know, I feel like people are definitely um, hands-on with, you know, commenting, liking, I'm just sharing. With the, with, the, with the older, you know, the, the guys that's been in it, supporting you guys. You know what I mean? I'm just... I don't, I don't know what it is, man. I mean, it's... I don't know. Okay. I don't know. I, I I can't I can't even make up an answer saying I know. I honestly don't know. I'm big fans of everyone, but it would yeah. definitely it would definitely be appreciated and it would feel good to have yeah. someone that you were raised on to be like, hey, I see you working, man. Let's let's get one in. Let's try yeah. to yeah. you know you, unite all this. You know what I'm saying? Most definitely. And because like I said, I'm always I'm always for the black community sticking together. Absolutely. But one thing I'm not with with us sticking together for one day. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Nah, like it, I said, it can't, it can't just be a it can't just be a one day thing. You know. Shout out to Buck and Starlito. Like, Man, big I shout haven't out. seen y'all on stage together in so long. Right. But but what does that mean for Nashville? Like, guess what? Y'all can be mad at me. I'm holding you guys accountable to what you're saying. So if if if, if you guys are saying that we're doing this to bring the city together, like, how are you bringing the city together? Is it in your way? Or is it for the people? So what do, like, Lotus, in your opinion, right? what should they be doing for you guys that you just think? Well, I'm going to be honest. For one, they have to they have to collectively see us work. Okay. You know, yeah. they have to collectively see the younger generation grind. You know, I, I feel like I feel like with Star, Buck, Kwani, you know, they really had to, like, you know, Get it out the mud to grind. Most definitely, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, like it's not just a, it's not just an internet thing. I think they want to see like real life motion. I think they yeah. want to see, you know, I bet can 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 homie do a show and bring out some people. Oh, fact, you fact. know what I'm saying? Like it has to be earned. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm I'm just keeping it all the way 100. A lot of people, a lot of people just won't start to get on the song with them. A lot of people yeah. just won't yeah. to get on the song with it. But how about you earn it? You know, yeah, not saying yeah. not saying that we're not earning it, but but you gotta work, bro. You gotta grind. But, 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 you know but, what I'm but, saying? But what is this? What I'm saying, like, uh, what is earning it? Like, I feel like this. Is what I feel like. I feel like. Talk this. to me. Talk to me. I feel like people like Sweet Poison, absolutely, Bree, Loaded, absolutely, uh, Mimi to go. I'm just calling out a couple names, right? You guys should have been to have projects with, you know what I'm you saying, with, with these guys. Like, and I'm and I'm just calling out these guys, like these guys, no, I don't give a damn, I don't care. Right. Like you guys should have been had projects. Um, I under in Atlanta, in Memphis, you got the goddies, they'll take they artists and uh, it ain't even gotta be the artist, but they'll take somebody and say, Hey, I'm gonna get behind you. Right. I'm gonna, you know what I'm saying, and put them out there. And so I think I think they can do more by embracing you guys, but with with that not happening at the rapid rate that I think, right. what keeps you moving to say like, well, I'm gonna just keep on grinding. They don't have to, you know. I'm gonna keep it all the way 100, bro, because I ain't depending on nobody to do nothing for me, bro. Starlito's not obligated to do nothing with me. Buck is not obligated to do nothing with me. Yeah. So with that being said, I'm gonna go out here and create it for myself. You know what I'm saying? Like respectfully, I'm gonna yeah. go out here and create it. I'm gonna go out here and create it for, you know, what I'm saying the people that are coming up with me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I didn't mean when I said myself, I didn't mean that in like a selfish way. But I'm Pat. saying like if 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 they're if if we're not doing a the record, then I what, what I'm gonna do? Stop. And I ain't picking on them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, but they should right. be doing records. You right. know what I'm saying? Absolutely. But you guys that's and, and I, I ain't picking on you, them at all. I, I feel you yeah. 125,000 yeah. percent But it's like I'm not going I'm not coming out here seeking validation from no man. Facts. Lotus gonna do his own shows. Lotus gonna sell his merch. Lotus gonna travel. I'm not gonna depend on a Star Lido feature. I'm not gonna depend on a Buck feature, bro. You feel me? Every anytime anybody see Lotus music out, I got my digital download course. I introduce myself to everybody in the room, bro. You feel me? Yeah. So that way I can create new fans everywhere I go. So that way, when it's time for Lotus to do a show, Lotus is gonna bring 200 people that he personally met and developed the relationship with to yeah. spend merch, to spend money with him, spend merch money, yeah. purchase hard sale tickets. I'm not finna depend on, I'm not finna depend on a a verse from someone who got it out the mud just like hey, me. I'm a, but, but listen, 100%. on everything I love, bro, when it happens. It's, it's gonna, gonna happen, happen at the right yeah. time, just like with me and you sitting down at this podcast, yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. Cause you know, we've we, we been going back and forth. You back know and what forth. Saying? It happened at back the right forth, time. You know what I'm saying? But I, but it, it would definitely it would definitely feel good to you know 
work work with some of the OGs, work with some of the big homies. Yeah, but I, I think that'd be good. Like I yeah, said, man, man I'm, I'm not finna and, and and respect love to everyone, but I'm not finna yeah. I'm not finna depend on no man. I, I don't feel like a man should be doing nothing for me. Thanks. Respectfully, well, I, I, I get what I like that. Yeah, you know, get what, look, respectfully, I like. Get what I'm gonna tell you why I like. Respectfully, you. I like you because I I don't see you get on this internet crying. I ain't <laughs> never seen no. Oh, y'all support me. Never. I just see uh, Lotus working. You know I'm what I'm work. saying. And so, uh, even it. when it's come to like the work level of what you do, like what are you doing outside of the, the art? Like, what are you doing to make sure you make it outside of not? You know, a lot of artists ain't working. You know what I mean? Right. So what? What? What's different about you that we supposed to like you? Mm -hmm. What's different about Lotus? Yeah, we well, I can like say you. I'm unapologetically myself. You know, I love developing personal connections with people. I love meeting new people. I'm a people person. You know, I'm for the people. Facts. You know, and um, everything is real and authentic. You're not getting a fabricated person. You're not getting a. I don't. I don't wake up and put on a costume. You know, what you hear is what you get. What you What you gonna learn about Low? You can hear it through his music. You can go stream that. Give me my flowers. EP and see the type of person Lotus Music is. Let's talk about Lotus Music and your yeah. music, like. Yes, you sir. make a lot of old freaky ass, sexy ass. We ain't gonna, shit. we ain't gonna, we ain't, we ain't gonna call it. Saying? Listen, listen, listen. You know, see, what? We like, ain't... are you really like doing <laughs> this to these girls, or like, what's going on? Because you make some, like, all your music got them be had me ready to have sex. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Listen, <laughs> shout out to the rewind, man. That yeah. motherfucking rewind. Not on a serious. That motherfucking re we like for me. Um, you know, I'm a, uh, I'm a fan of you first. Thank you, you know what I'm saying? Thank you. Because uh, I'm really not a fan of nobody, That's but I'm a fan in a way of like I support you. you That's know real. Because I real. ain't support anybody who's just doing any old fucking thing. You Absolutely, know what I'm, I'm a fan first. So where did the music come from? Where all this sick shit come from? Um, I, I'm not. I'm not gonna necessarily say my music is just targeted towards I sex. No, it ain't. It ain't. No, it's no, no. For sure, for sure. I get I what you're like saying. I'm gonna bring it. I'm gonna bring it. I'm gonna bring it all around. It. I'm gonna bring, it, bring go, it all around. Let go. So, let go. so like with so yeah. like with Lotus Man, I, I'm not gonna necessarily say my music is just targeted straight towards sex. I love um making music for women. I love making music about women, and I like um. Just I, I feel like I feel like I can I feel like I speak their language when it comes to, you know, how women should be treated, heartbreaks. You know, I, I've lived a lot of life myself. Right. Yeah. And I and just, this I, damn young age, yeah. you ain't nothing about 22, 23. Yeah, yeah, come you, on, man. All you this crazy, sex you shit crazy, this crazy. Age. But um I, just, I call them I call them vibes, man. You know, I make I make music for I make music for the beautiful ladies that in that that love themselves and I make music for the for the player niggas. You know what I'm saying? The the player people. What, you know what I'm saying? What makes um uh, what makes Lotus happy? Like, yeah. Um, only thing I always see, I always see your grind. Yeah. Like you don't really post nothing but your music. Right. And matter of fact, shout out to Double Solid because he's in here. I call him Deshaun. Like y'all niggas call him Double Solid. Goddamn, I call him Deshaun. Want to talk about the relationship? Yeah. What made you want to do business with him? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody they don't never want to talk about the people that's behind the scene because I have seen him post you. More than he done posted anything. Absolutely, absolutely. You know absolutely. what I'm saying. So what? So 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 what made you want to just kind of like absolutely. dumb down and and work work over there? Right. So um, I'm gonna say this. I met I met Big Bro through the uh, through the internet. Okay. Shout out my boy French man. Um, we was on we was on live, and me and me and my boy uh French. He's a very popular engineer. That's my dog, my boy. Um, we was on live, man. And Solid joined the live, and they had already had a prior relationship. But we was in the studio working. Yeah. And um, like we always do. And Solid sent some beats through. And we knocked out like every single beat, sent it back to him. Yeah. You know, and that made him be like, hold on, bro, what the hell? Like, yeah, going up. Yeah, yeah. Know? And then we 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 got a chance to um, you know, sit down, do lunch, and then we just developed a relationship first. We we developed a solid relationship before we even started doing business. And that's that's what I like to do. You know, I don't hey. just jump into business. You know, I, I have to be able to sit down at the table and eat with you before I can even think about doing anything music related. Have he got you any pussy or anything? You know what I'm saying? Like, nah, you know, I'm, these CEOs <laughs> both come with, you know what I'm saying? Have he got nah, you any pussy nah, or anything? I, he don't, I, you know, I, no girls or nothing. You nah, know what I'm, I mean? Come I'm, with um, that. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm just pretty. Asking. I'm pretty. I'm you know pretty. I'm, I'm trying pretty, to figure out. Do what I'm trying to figure out. I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> look at, look at, he kind of dragged you in. Look out, look out, look out, look out, look out, look out. I'm just saying, because you got your push and not that you need yeah. Solid, but you, you know what I'm saying? You you had to make a choice, you know what I mean, yeah, to deal yeah, yeah. with him. So I'm trying Man, to figure no, out what I'm, 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 you know I'm gonna definitely say, I'm gonna definitely say why um 
while doing business, man, everything is everything has been on the up and up. Everything has been everything has been great. So I ain't gonna, you know, pussy is a it's a broad term. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I can I can say the I can say the the music is elevated, the um the brand is elevated, and everything has worked in worked in our favor. But you, you and I mean, if you're if you're a business person, you know what um you know what comes with wins. Okay. So I don't. Really, um, you asked you asked me you asked me what what makes me happy. Like you yeah. said, you okay, said. Okay, let's go back. Said, I want to know what makes <laughs> Lotus happy. You know what I'm saying? I want to know yeah, um, what makes you because, like I said, uh, go back. I'm glad you went back to that. Yeah. You don't really never post nothing outside wow, of of your business. So what makes <clears throat> what what's what's keep what makes Lotus happy? Man, I'm gonna keep it real. The and it, it ain't and, pussies. No, no, no. no, no, no. It's definitely, it's definitely, it. it's definitely. Wipe not. it out. <laughs> it ain't, it ain't motivated. It ain't motivated by the sex. Um, man, what makes me happy is seeing the people around me happy. Okay, okay. You know, um, I told myself that you know while I'm in my twenties, I'm a, I'm a, I'm dedicating my whole twenties to to making something of myself. So uh-huh. if I'm just being a hundred percent honest, like I have fun, but I have fun through the the work like life is a okay I'm, I'm just being honest big bro my, my life is a grind yeah yeah you know like I, I i you know i might go to the movies i might travel but it's like everything anywhere i go i'm thinking man, i could get some content right here man i could do this i could do that i'm just so locked in right now fam it's like i have fun through the work like i gotta yeah. i gotta make some of myself like yeah. you feel me my mom's still working okay you feel okay. me like i'm trying to retire her at a young age yeah. like i don't really i grew up watching kobe and listening to Thanks. Lil wayne bro like they had like if you if you understand like if you if you get that you get it like i grew up watching kobe and listening to Lil wayne and and, and those two people have just such a grind about himself like it's like wayne like hey, Wayne go platinum every day. Be like, let I me, bet. Eat, let, eat you some soup. Let's get back to the work. You know let, what I'm saying? Let like, me ask you a question. Question on that. Like, um, be. I want you to be real, real honest about this. I will. Um, what do your people like? We talking about your siblings or your mother or dad. Mm-hmm. What do they feel about your career and what you're doing? Man, I'm gonna keep it real. So like, my my family is very supportive. I would say this. You know, I, I got kind of my dad kind of old school man. Okay. Yeah. Pops kind of old school, so he um, pops believe in stability. Okay, you know, what I'm saying he come from that generation, so he don't he, know nothing about this. No, he no, he, no, he okay. no, okay. he's he's one of them. He's like my dad is like man, and I lo- and I love my dad so much, man. But it's like, you know, <laughs> my dad's kind of my dad's kind of straight laced. Okay. You know, he like, um, like straight life, like like what? Like, I ain't gonna call. I ain't gonna call my. I ain't gonna call my dad like my dad's not lame. Okay, but he, <laughs> he's the type of man. You he, know, he, he t- he's like a little square type. He of, took, he he took care of his family. He yeah. took care of me, okay. and, me and my brothers. That's a good thing. Provide, See, we making provide, it a bad thing. That's a good thing. Provided a life. Provided a good life for us. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Him and my mom been married. Him and my mama been married for like 36 years. Wow. You know, so no, it's we, like, no, we, that's how yeah, it's supposed to be. Yeah, you know what I mean? So don't me? see. They, they were, look, this is the thing about that, and I want to, and I want to, I want to, I want to dump into that real quick. Yeah. Why do we feel like because you had a daddy and a mom, yeah. like that's awkward? No, that's like, no, and, and that's and how that's it's supposed crazy. to be. Crazy. That's crazy, bro. Like I, I grew up with my mom and my pops, man. I seen like, I seen, I seen what real love looked like. You know. See my dad love my mom. Yeah, I seen yeah. I seen like and my man I rich. We grew up, you know, average American family. But right. I, but I seen the but I seen the effort. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And it's like that's how I'm kind of able to like when I'm like when I'm writing and I'm I'm creating records. It's like when I'm talking about love, like I can come from a space where like I grew up in a I grew up in a household of you seen love, that. bro. You I seen, seen love, yeah, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I I really I really seen love. So that's why it's kind of easy for me to I bet play that Mm, I do they really exactly believe that about. you can be uh, the biggest artist in the world? That's absolutely. what I want to know. Okay, absolutely. Do they? Do I'm saying absolutely. you know they really believe that? Man, listen. Moms and pops and family believe that you can be the biggest. Man, listen, man. My mom, my mom, my biggest fan. Not saying my dad not my biggest fan, man. but it's just yeah. like when well, his generation, his generation comes from the. I bet you say that with well, shit. Show me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like it's it's not really too many pats on the back. Yeah, you know yeah. it's more like I cool. bet. No, like, you, good thing. you said you said you you said you want to do this. This how you coming? I bet. Show me. I be trying to be hard on you. I'm just, you I'm just for me. I be yeah. trying to be hard on y'all. Like yeah. I don't want y'all to think like this is just a walk in the park. <sighs> like you know what I'm saying. I don't want y'all Not to. Yeah, that's why, yeah, see, I'm like, yeah, we gonna get it in. That's nah. why I tell them. Solid. That's why I tell them. Solid. Yeah, we gonna get it in. 
Yeah. You know what I mean? But it's just like, because I don't want, I don't want y'all to think it's just a walk in the park. Because you got to think for me, I've been on the road with Buck and, and the star. I, I, I have really been out there on that road to know like what it takes. And that's why, that, that's what I feel what makes me different though. That, that's what I feel what makes Lotus music stand out because Lotus is a real hustler, bro. Yeah. I'm not depending on no internet fam. Okay, facts. facts. Like I, I, oh, go out, I go out, I go out, yeah. and I, I go out and I shake hands, bro. You feel me? I'm not depending like I could get a post to do 7,000, 8,000 likes, but that then that night I'm somewhere where nobody knows me facts. passing out my digital download facts. cards, trying to gain more fans. Check this out. Facts. Every scan is a new fan. Ooh. So the more people that I meet, the more streams I get, the more money I make, the more hard ticket sales, the more hard ticket sales I do, the more popular Lotus music is. Right. All from the hustle. That's why, like, I'm not really, I'm not really focused on fun, bro. That's why yeah. when you ask me what do I do for yeah, fun, you, like, you, bro, you, I, you just work it. I I'm work. Just, I'm just working. <laughs> I don't like fun is fun is non-existent right now, bro. Because we, because we on a mission. We have we have we have a quota we have to meet. We yeah, have objectives definitely. that we have to. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's that, how it, look, that's just how it is. If you, you can you can ask, oh, like everything is work for me. Like I be that's why I, look, I don't have a girlfriend for this this this, this one particular reason. Like if I'm they sing, call I'm me too, and brother. I need to go to Atlanta, I'm out of here. Gone. Like, you know what I'm saying? To take care of my business. But look, you know, I thought about something and I want to ask you first before I go into what I'm going. Yeah. Like um I'm happy to be here, man. I know, I know I just, you know, no, I'm, I'm happy, happy to be here. I'm happy, I'm happy you're with, here. You know what I'm saying? I'm happy you're here. Super happy. You know what I'm saying? I'm happy we can go back to it. We can go back to it. I just had to let you know. Yeah, I'm happy you're here too. I, yeah. I love this. Okay, so look. <laughs> so, um, yeah. the women is super, in my opinion, has took over the rap. Facts. You know what I'm saying? Ooh -wee. Like, why do you think that? Like, why, why do you think? How do you think that happened? Because this is something, like, this is not a conversation that oh, people want to have. I got to. They don't want to have this conversation, really. But how the hell did women just come in and take over? Because Sexy Red is my favorite artist. Yeah, yeah. I like Sexy Red and Glow. They like, they, yeah. when it comes to rap, they like on top of my favorite. And I'm a, I'm a real masculine man. Like, I ain't, I ain't gay or nothing. Like, I, ain't never, woman, I, I ain't never had no man. And I don't woman, never do it. that. But anyway, go ahead. Keep it honest. Yeah. I'm going to keep it real, man. When you go to a sexy red, glow Rilla, lotto concert, shit, niggas ain't dying. Ooh. Niggas ain't dying at no Ooh. sexy red, no lotto concert. Ooh, I didn't even e think about that. E everybody's so tough, bro. The, they've pushed this black narrative of black men. Just everybody want to beef. Everybody want to die. It's, it's so dangerous to go to a show. Mm. Like, it's so dangerous to go to a show, bro. When you go to a lotto concert, you go to a Meg Thee Stallion concert, you go to a um, Glow concert, it's nothing but women and it's nothing but love. And they spending. Ooh. When you go to a... It's it's always like if you go to if you go to your favorite rapper concert, they sure. might be your quote unquote street nigga or whatever. Yeah, Respectfully, yeah. it's like I bet it's like some it's like something always happened. They bring in the they bring in the real street. It's the energy. Okay. It's like it's like the real it's the energy. It's the aura. It's the right. it's the cloud that travels with that artist. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like like with these women, bro, it's they they speak and they truth. And I mean it's it ain't yeah. dying at no show, bro. You feel me? That the it's it's this objective that everything just has to be so tough and hard, and it's just it's it's getting really. It was sad. time. For, it was time for a change, bro. Look, and the reason I went into these women because I want to I want to play this little it's a little game. It's new. It's yeah. the first time I did it on my show. Cool. And I want to start with you. It's Let's called Rob Still a Kill. Rob Still a Kill. Okay. Okay. So um, sexy Rob red. Still a kill. Rob Still a Kill. Rob steal a kill. Can we? Can we? Can we oh, okay, I know it's the game, but can we like? If we talking about women, can we do like Mary? No, uh -uh. Smash? no, 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 whoa, whoa, hold on. I'm still. I don't know. I ain't no rob. I don't do none of. I don't do none of the stuff that he's talking about. Like I don't. I don't do none of this. I don't rob. Okay. I don't steal. I don't okay. kill. Because okay, we, we gonna love, rob. We could. Sex Ray's gonna rob you. We he, he the pick. Okay, look. Donald Trump robs still a kill. I'm a musician. I don't get into politics. 
I seen that on a Michael Jackson movie. <laughs> when Joe Jackson was like, now, Michael, remember, they ask you about politics, what do you say? I'm just a musician. I, don't, I ain't no politician. Okay. That's what you say. All uh, right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Avery on a personality. Rob still a kill. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I love Avery on the personality. I wouldn't do none of that to that queen. She's amazing. You know, I want to talk. I want to talk about this to, uh, when she came on here, but I'm gonna talk about it with you. Like, um, you know, I heard y'all was together. Like, what happened? It's everything. Oh my god! Oh my god! I just want to ask. Hey, um, what happened? I think. I think. I thought when 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 I heard that, I said, "Ooh, that was a good look." Dang man, um. I believe, man, it was, um, I believe, man, it was timing, you know, okay. and I'm going to keep it real. I'm going to keep it 100% honest. Keep it 100%. Yeah. I messed that up. You know, I messed that up. Um, man, look, bro, I'm going to keep it real. Let me ask you a question. See, like, you got me thinking now. But hold on. Like, let, let me ask you a question. Now. That's, no, let me ask you something. Damn. Cause I, cause I, I want to be honest about. I want, I want you to be honest with this. Like, yeah. um, mm. both of you guys was coming up at the same time. Mm -hmm. Now, all the popularity she's got, you know, she's around every celebrity. I'm, th I'm, thank you, Avon, for being my friend. Mm -hmm. I mean, cause you know, Avon and Bree, that's <clears throat> two of my top people who always link me. Yeah. You know, what I'm saying with people, and I respect them. But yeah. now all that she's doing, do you ever kind of look and be like, "Dang, I yeah. could have had that." No, I'm gonna keep it real, man. It's not like it's not like um, we're not cool. It's not like we're not cordial. I just uh, <laughs> shit, bro. On my side, I was just I was just so focused on becoming something. Like I didn't really fill her cup okay. the way it needed to be filled, you know? And we've been through Was a it lot. money or was nah, it? Nah, it was never money, okay. bro. Okay. And me, me, me and me and Paige, see I see look, you got me calling a real name. Okay. You got me calling a real name. Right. Me and yeah. Paige we, it was never based on no bread. Me and that girl, me and that girl have been talking since like, you know, twenty eighteen. I met her when I was super young. We right. we been we've been off and on for like shit, like five, six years. When last time y'all talk? Shoot. Uh a couple weeks ago. Okay. But I mean, um, couple weeks ago, couple nah, weeks ago, it's just, it's just, it's couple just, weeks. it was just, you know, I was just, I was just, I didn't, I didn't feel her cup the way, the way it needed to be filled. And I mean, you know, it's all love. Like we've been through some like real, real, real life experiences that I ain't going to say on camera, you know, cause that ain't yeah. nobody else's business. We won't know your business. But, um, Can't, I get a on here. She'll, she'll tell me shit. Go, but go ahead. Nah. Yeah. 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 yeah but, I mean. um, but nah, that's, um, that's my dog, man. That's my, that's my, that's my queen for life. You know what I'm saying? Like, regardless, like, you know, timing is everything. Yeah. We always talk about timing yeah, is, is everything. Is. And I know at the end of the day, you know, she loved me and I love her. You know, she growing. I'm growing. I'm in my lane. She in her lane. Right. And, like, just just even with you saying, like, oh, man, I see her doing this. You be like, dang. Yeah. It's like. I'm just putting me. Listen, listen, listen. I'm about to, I'm about to, I'm about okay. to. I want you to bring home. I'm about to let you know some, some real shit. Okay. It's like, man, when you re when when you really love a person, you know, you never like, dang. It's like, man, I'm happy, yeah, ecstatic. You feel me? Cause she growing, I'm growing in my career too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Shit moving for me also. Are you happy for her growing it was, though? It was never. Want, it was. Are never, you happy for her growing? Or do you want like stay a little stagnant? Because I'd be like bro. stay a little motherfucking stagnant. Because nah, I'm we you ain't going never, to be. We ain't. We ain't never. I'm, I'm a hater on my ex girlfriend. Nah, nah. We ain't never. I'm a hater. We ain't never. Um. We ain't never. We ain't never coming at it like that, bro. Okay. And we ain't never coming at it like that. But like I am. I'm, I'm coming at it like I'm that. I'm just being. I'm just being 100 percent honest and being 100 percent like Thanks. a real man and just letting you know, man. Like I, I, I was the one. I was the one that. You know, I, I messed that up. But I, I ain't saying, yeah. like, me, me, like, I'm just 
the whole corporate, you know what I'm yeah. saying? People, it's 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 three sides to every story. Do you think you My good side, in relationships? True. But you do you think you're good in relationships? Do you think, think I'm good do you in relationships? Think, do you think you can handle a relationship or do you think like you got some growing to do when it comes to relationship? Because mm. look, this is what I'm gonna say. Mm. And uh, I she rarely told, she must have told you something, bro. Y'all must have had a conversation. You asking some real. I'm gonna keep it real. Now nah, we on camera. I'm letting you know you you asked. Yeah, we did. Had to, had that, to. I didn't even look. No I, way. I'm just keeping teeth. I gotta keep no real. Way. I didn't even know y'all was together until she told me. That's I'm my little sister. Like, I'm looking that's like my little, that's my little sister. Nah, right nah, there. And and that's, so, yeah, nah. And you know what? And you know what? I'm gonna keep it real. You know how some people? I'm gonna keep it real. Some people, if you would have brought up a sticky situation, they would have been like, "Hold on, fam. Like we ain't talking about that." You feel me? But I respect you because I know you respect her and you love her. And I see, and I know that you respect me. Yeah. I, I appreciate you even diving into that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cause yeah. I, I ain't ducking nothing. I'm not, I'm not, you yeah, know what I'm saying? I'm, yeah. I'm comfortable with who I am as a man and I'm but, comfortable with whatever. the, with, 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 you know, some of the things that I've done and I'm not perfect. You know Fact. what I'm saying? Fact. I'm not perfect at all. But to answer your question, um, do I feel like I'm good in relationships? Um, I feel like I, sometimes I, struggle with emotionally tapping in with an individual. You know what I'm saying? Because like with me, do it got something to do with your career? Like, is it, is it like career wise? Like, um, again, mm -hmm. me and queen, shout out to queen. She's here. Uh, my girl today. We, and we was talking about art, artists complimenting each other. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, uh, you know, for me, because I, I look at it like this, it's, if Lotus and Avery on a personality is, is together and it's this it's this powerful uh connection, right. the industry is gonna accept it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cause it's just like, you know what I mean? And I ain't we ain't finna keep on talk. We ain't gotta keep on talking about this. I, you know but what, I'm you, just and a lot of it and a lot asking. of it and a lot of it was kinda and a lot of it was kinda like and and like I said, during that whole process, bro, I was still learning, bro. Like, yeah. she's older than me. She's four or five years older than me. You okay. feel me? Just keeping it real. Okay. I had to understand that. And then after this, bro, we're going to we, we yeah. move on. No, I just, I just then, want to hear. I'm No, nah, listen. Listen, you know, I, I... Man, as a man, and I'm going to keep it real. As a man, sometimes you got to let that pride go, bro. Yeah. Pride yeah. kills, dog. Yeah. Pride kills, bro. And then, like... The younger, the younger me. See, I'm, I'm, I've always been this grinder, but like mentally, man, I, I got started so young, but my brain, I, I wasn't fully developed. And my brain still isn't fully developed. Fact. But it's yeah. like, you got to understand, bro, when you got a solid woman that's working just like how you working. Yeah. Ain't no she win, you win, it's y'all win. And sometimes, bro, as a man, bro, that pride. A destroy you and your relationship. When you, you okay, I mean? so so now we're talking about being an artist yeah. and being an artist in the industry. Do you think it's better to have a woman while you're doing what you do, or do you think it's better just being single? Um, I'm always I'm always pro black love. Yeah, I'm always oh. pro love. Me period. You feel me? me? I'm trying to get Queen to love me. That's all. <laughs> I'm just playing. Go ahead. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Sip, sips tea. Yeah, but um, <laughs> but um. I would say it's great to have um, a relationship, okay? Because you need someone not now if they if they understand, bro. See, they uh -huh. they have to you you and them have to be on. Just you. We were just talking about that. No, I'm just, we just had a conversation <laughs> for about real, this. For real, for real, you know what I'm saying? Okay, just, go yeah. ahead, but keep going. Yeah. We said, I'm just, you I guys, just, you guys have to be on the same side of the street. Yeah, yeah. There can't be no. Oh well, you know. She gets this and do it. No, you guys have to be on the same page at all. You guys have to make time for y'all and make time for the business. It's all about time management. It's all about managing your time. You yeah. feel me? And um, you gotta you gotta get you someone that's gonna pour into you. That's not just right. gonna that's not just steal gonna steal your energy. Yeah, steal your energy just and then try to then try to just be around because they see you lit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. You want you want someone with some motion. They say if you want someone that's gonna get up. Handle the business just like you, and y'all get back, y'all come back together and be like, I bet. Well, I got this done today. I got that done today. If cool. If Lotus you know get I mean? if, if 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 Lotus, if you get um if you get that high power deal today, yeah, 
do you have any um, strife or beef with people who you felt like didn't work with you? And if they say, hey, if mm. they hit you up, be like, hey, Lola, this work. Mm. <laughs> hey, man, I love these questions. Um, no. I'm saying that, and I'm saying that from a place of honesty because. Ooh, yeah. For one, it has to make sense. Yeah. Yeah. Everything has to make sense. One hundred percent. Yeah, but you're yeah. not. But God ain't gonna reward spiteful behavior. Yeah, you know what I'm saying you got to get that hate out your heart, bro. A lot of these people, a lot of these people hold grudges. It's it's like I like I said at the beginning. It's nobody's obligation to, to fuck with you. you. I'm gonna tell it's you nobody's something. obligation to help me. Look real quick, respectfully. And I, and real quick, respectfully, and I want to. Um, you know, everybody always. They always break uh stuff off in spiritual ways. Uh, and I'm you know I'm a spiritual guy. I read the Bible back and man. forth. But look, this is this Me is too. this this is what happened. Um, do you know Jesus' first miracle? Jesus' first miracle. Yeah. Enlighten me. Jesus' first miracle was he turned water into wine. Right. But um he happened to be at a party mm -hmm. and they was like, Hey Jesus, we out of wine. And and Jesus said, Well, you know, it ain't it ain't got nothing to do with me. Like, oh, it ain't got nothing to do with me. And then um, his, his his mama was telling him that. Mm. But then Jesus kind of came to it. He thought like, oh, shit. Let me show them what I can do. And so my whole point is making is like, don't never get offended about people watching what you do because everybody got to see that you can that you can handle it before they even come around. Right. And so I'm just so my, my whole point is making is like don't never be offended who don't support you right now. You know what I'm saying? Because right. we have to see you doing what you do. Yeah. If, even for me like yeah, I met you and it was cool and Lotus and I followed you and all this, but I had to actually watch you to make sure that you was qualified to come on the platform. If that makes sense. And you know what? I respect that hundred percent, bro. I respect that hundred ten percent. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? I feel like I feel like a a lot of problem a lot of problems with artists now is like everybody's just feels so entitled. It's that entitlement, bro. That entitlement and that pride kills everything. Cause Fact. it's like, yeah. why do you feel so entitled? Title. Yeah. <laughs> do you like feel somebody like, owe you something? You like, know what I'm saying? You, you feel like yeah. you feel like because you get five hundred likes on a on a picture and some comments, some hard eyes. And you do some views on YouTube, you feel like you're deserving to come on someone's platform who put the work in. You know what I'm saying? Like that entitlement has to go. Yeah. Like I yeah. told you, like even even going back to before when we was talking about the Buck and Starlito thing. Yeah. Why do I feel entitled for Starlito to call me and be like, hey Lotus, let's do a song? I feel entitled because I feel like Lotus doing his thing and I feel like Lotus is, is, is worthy of Starlito and yeah. Buck and all. Maybe, that. maybe, maybe well, that's just me. Maybe that's just maybe that's, that's just, just that just might be me. Right. I respect it. I feel you know like I, I feel like I am too, but I'm not. But I'm not gonna go on the internet and be oh, like, no, not at all, not at all. Nah, bro, we just not gonna keep working. Yeah, that's all you can do, bro. At the end of the day, the work is gonna speak, bro. Even when, even when I get that major deal, even when I'm touring, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. Even when Adriana ain't messing with you, you still gonna do your goddamn thing, right? <laughs> Even when she ain't hey, even. Shout out, shout out to the queen, Adriana. I love you. <laughs> she is real. I love you. She, you heard but, that, um, Adriana. I'm nah, trying to figure facts. 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 I love her. But, um, but it's like, but it's like, bro, you can't depend on nothing. Yeah, yeah. We used to talk about that. Me, me and Paige used to talk about that all the time, man. Because I used to get so angry. I was like, man, I need to be doing this. I should be doing this. Man. People, he should, they should be coming to me. Yeah. She used to be like, bro, shut up. Yeah. Work. Yeah. Keep, keep, <laughs> you feel me? keep the work. Yeah. So that that's I got that. I got I got that. That's why I got that, that dog in me, man. I'm hustling. What um where do Lotus see himself not in five years, right? Not in one year. Um, where do you put yourself when it's coming to this entertainment? Mm -hmm. Like, what do you like? What do you see yourself at? Right. I see myself, I see myself with a with a solid core fan base, man. Solid core fan base. I'm able to tour the world. I'm able to sell out shows. I'm able to sell merch. I'm able to create a life for me, myself, my family, uh, eventually some kids. Okay. And actually having a real career um, as an entertainer. Yeah. You see, I'm I'm more than just a I'm more than just an artist, bro. Yeah. You know, I have okay. a great I have a very great personality. Let's I can talk, do anything. Let's talk about this. I want to because yeah. I don't want to forget this in the interview. Like, um, yeah. one thing I can say about you is. You care about the kids, like, like yo, 
I'm going yes, to tell you something. Yes, and sir. you stop freaking doing it. And I was enjoying it. See, this is what I don't like, Solid. I don't like when somebody doing something and I be enjoying it. And then they quit doing it. When you was going to all these different places with the phone and like, I was waking up in the morning. You was like, here, like, hey, this person doing this. Like, you know what I mean? Your motivation, like, mm-hmm. this shit was like, I see, we people be watching and you don't even know. <laughs> that shit was like, I missed that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, start them back, man. I need to start them back. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. It's I, crazy. I missed that. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. you know, and and even when it, it, it comes to like, we know this internet is full of content. How yeah. do Lotus figure out what content he's doing and when and where? Right, so... um. I collectively, I collectively um, have a, I got a team of people, man. I got yeah. a team of people that I sit down and. Is Avery you know, on the team? My bad. Nah. <laughs> She's showing. I'm sorry. Avery, oh, but go ahead. Ariana was, Ariana was, when we was together, she was, we was she, rocking out. We was rocking out for she sure. She ain't supporting you like that no more. You know what I'm saying? Nah, nah. Okay. Definitely but go not. ahead. <laughs> definitely not. But, <laughs> she's, definitely she's, not. She's supporting behind the scenes, but, but I don't. But definitely I don't, not. I don't know if that's even happening. Okay. <laughs> but um, said no hate in my heart, bro. You know, she's oh, doing, yeah. doing my you thing. You still love her. Still yeah, in love. So I love. Yeah, but yeah. But um, um, nah, man. I everything everything that I do is content, and since I have such a a vibrant personality, man, I feel like anywhere I go, like I'm I'm doing this, I'm doing that. So what you fell in love with, man? I used to do um motivation Monday videos, man. Every morning, every morning. I loved it. I would, I would go on a I would go on a um a mile run, and I would um have my tripod. And uh, I would just motivate people, man. You know what I'm saying? Look, it's Monday. Monday motivation with Lotus. You feel me? Like, and I'm also talking about when you was going to people, you'll be at a certain thing. You'll yeah. Bobby Jones, you'll be like, hey. And, and it was, you know what I'm saying? I'm talking about all that. Those, you know what I'm saying? We those, missed that. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah those were those. Um, I used to do, um, when I had this record called, well, it was still, still new, put the work in, man. I used to go yeah. to different black-owned businesses, and I used to ask them three questions. You know what I'm saying? What do you yeah. do? What do you represent? And how do you put the work in, man? And I went to so many um, popping Black businesses, man. Like shout out Queen yeah. Cole. I, I, I was, I was there. You, 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 you turned me on to some stuff that yeah. I didn't even freaking know you about. Me? Because, you know what I'm saying? And yeah. that, that's another thing. Uh, what I respect about you. Yeah, I respect that you really like is grinding and supporting the culture. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Because it was, it was a lot of places, places you went to. I didn't even know what the hell. But I was like, Lord, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, um, it's a lot of people watching just because people don't like, because people don't share. They're watching, you know what I'm saying? And so uh, you have to just, I'm, I'm telling you, always keep doing what you do and don't don't think it's fade now. You know what I'm saying? Like, you might be doing something, you might be like, oh, man, people might be tired of it, but they ain't tired of it because your energy is yeah. like, we, we we looking for Lotus to come through our, you know what I'm saying? You know what, I, I, I appreciate you saying that, man, because, you know, Ricky World's podcast. I got to be honest, right? If you're last subscribe, be honest. This is a solid podcast. Subscribe. You know, sometimes I would, I would, ah, man. As I said, I, I've just, I've just grown and matured for over these yeah. past two and a half years, bro. I used to just be like so mad, bro, because I used to go support people and yeah. go to their events, and I used to be like, I bet when it's my turn, return the favor. And then when they didn't return the favor, I used to have some feel real like, yeah. I used to feel some type of way. You know what I'm saying? But over the past two and a half years, I just, man, I realized that that wasn't genuine support that I was showing. Ooh. Genuine because you support. Because you want something back. Because I was wanting something in return, bro. Okay. Genuine support is when you unapologetically support someone. Yeah. Because it's in your heart. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to his show because I'm a fan. Yeah. I'm going yeah. to this event because I'm a fan. Yeah. That's genuine, bro. You feel me? When someone do something for you and they're not looking for nothing in return, it's because they love you. That's genuine love. And you know, over the, over the past two, over the past two and a half years, I've grown to understand that what I was doing mm. wasn't genuine. And this is and this just and this just me being honest, bro. Facts. Just me being 100%. understanding who I am as a young man and developing, bro. I'm not fucking perfect. Yeah, facts. nobody is perfect. Hey, you know Brown, the person that'll pep tell you that he ain't perfect because he, you know. But go ahead. <laughs> hey, bro, he <laughs> must want me and Pays to get back together, I mean, man. Okay. <laughs> he talk, he talking <laughs> no, spicy I mean, but, right now. But go ahead. But no, and she know me as but, Noah too, so she'll probably get but, pissed off if I say look, this. Bro. Ooh, but look, cares? but look, Lotus. Um, that's my dog. But yeah, it just wasn't genuine. But look, you know what I'm saying. But now I'm, everything is just super genuine, bro. And I'm just uh, happy to be around, happy to be alive. If when you, alive, you do, subscribe, when you do something, um, that was hard. I'm gonna tell you something. 
Like when Slim and Huskies bag you up. Shout out to Slim and Huskies. Man, shout out Clint Demo, EJ, man, the whole team. You did what I'm saying. Y'all need to come on my motherfucking Slim and Huskies. Y'all ain't been on my show yet. Everybody done been here. Lotus done been here. Y'all ain't been on my motherfucking show yet. Y'all, y'all been to tap man. in. That's the but family. They, but they take on tap in. So yeah. But um, when it comes to dealing with real business people, right. like, what do you actually know about the business in what you're doing? Oh yeah, man, I'm hundred. Like, are you are you a hundred percent, or you just kind of hundred percent tapped in? I got my okay. hand all the way in the cake. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like when it comes to when it comes to the business of Lotus Music, when mm-hmm. it comes to you know just everything, bro. I'm I'm a hundred percent invested. Like everything that goes on from the how much to are the, you willing to risk you know when saying? it comes to your music career? Like when it's when because everybody I want to sign a deal, right? And uh, everybody say three sixty or this. How much are you willing to risk of Lotus? If we're talking about a percentage of hundred percent, how much of Lotus are you willing to risk to get to where you gotta go? How much of Lotus am I willing to risk? Yeah, are you to willing to, to say yourself? <laughs> nah, man. First and foremost, man, we represent God, and we going, we okay. going, the, we going the right way, not the wrong way at all yeah. times. And when it comes to when it comes to how much of a percentage, okay. quote unquote, quotation marks okay. around percentage, um, everything just has to make sense. sense. Yeah. Like, I, I always talk about everything making sense because you, you're not going to come in, you're not going to come into this game just assuming that you're going to get the best situation possible. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You, can't, you yeah. can't just think if you're a new artist that they're supposed to give you 100% and they yeah. walk away with nothing. Like, bro, you got to give something to give yeah. some. Facts, facts. The God way. You feel me? Yeah. So it's not like it's not like I'm thinking like, all right, bet, bro. I know my first deal, bro. I'm gonna get this and I'm gonna get this. Yeah. I'm gonna get that. You know what I'm saying? Everybody has to work. You have yeah. to grind. You have to prove that you're deserving of getting eighty percent. And the label that's putting up hundred percent of the money, it get twenty percent. Oh wow, that's, 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 that. a, that's a lot. Yeah, you have to prove that's that. A lot. Bro. You feel yeah. me? So it's like that. That's why. That's why I feel like it's so many artists nowadays that are just falling off the wayside, bro, yeah. because they are not proving. They're, they are just relying on the internet, bro. Right. You feel me? Like, yeah. people don't even do meet and greets no more for yeah. real at the yeah. shoe stores. And, like, bro, you, the people want to shake hands with you and give you a hug, they bro. Wanna, you know what I'm hey, saying? They want to they they actually con- yeah. gotta tap in. So, yeah. so, it's like I said, just just bringing it, bringing it back to your question, man. It just has to it just has to make sense, bro. You feel me? And before I'm presented to that situation, if I have a lot of leverage and it makes sense, then we going to make it make sense. sense. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Point it, blank period. It, it, even with you... Before you even was doing any of this, like yeah. what? And I know this is a quote unquote a question that everybody asks. Yeah, like what really made you one of the music? Man. Like what really made you say I'm gonna do this shit? Yeah. Because you are actually doing it yeah. at a high level. See, I don't brag. One thing about me, I'm telling you, like anybody gonna tell you, I'm just an honest person. Like I don't mm-hmm. care. Lotus, like you cool. I love you, but if yeah. you were sorry, I'll say Lotus, you sorry. <laughs> I might go online. You know what I'm saying? I might go online and say, you know yeah. what I mean? I enjoy Starlito show, but it ain't the show that it, 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 you know what I'm saying? Like me, I'm more of a crunk, you know what I'm saying? Type of person. Yeah. But, um, what makes your music want to make people come out that mm-hmm. you think? Mm-hmm. What makes people want to, what makes people want to support Lotus? What makes people want to support What Lotus. you think? I'm just saying what you no, think. No, 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 no. Just what I think. It's the authentic, relatable music. You know, like I said, I I don't just make music for the rich people, the okay. the the um the niggas that want to stunt, the niggas that you yeah. the no, bro. I make everyday music for the regular person. Everybody's been through a relationship. Everyone's yeah. went through a heartbreak. Everyone's it's lived the life. Shit. What you talking? But go ahead. But go ahead. <laughs> Wait, we going know, back to that. <laughs> every, everyone's lived life. Yeah. I'm pretty sure a, a lot of people have indulged in adult activities, also. Yeah. So I mean, it's I just make relatable music, bro, and people latch on to something that they can feel on a personal level, mm-hmm. something that they can actually relate to. They're drawn towards it, and they wants to be, and they want to be a part of the movement. Right. So that's why I feel my music would bring people out. Yeah. You know, I got this song called Soft Girl Era. 
They've been <laughs> when I say they've been they've been tapping on that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like give us a yeah. soft girl arrow because I was telling and not to keep throwing you out there, Queen. I was telling Queen right. today. I was like, you know, we we more like the women. That's like girly, you know what I'm saying? We we kind of missed that, you know hey, what yo, I'm saying? Let's so talk, let's soft girl talk era. about it. Let's talk you about it. You know what I'm saying? Let's talk about soft girl era. Is what yeah. is that song like surrounded by? And you know, women are. I, I believe I believe women are tired of the, the be confron- careful the confrontational be careful. toxic shit, man. You know, okay. I, I'm, I mean, I'm talking about in in the song. I'm I said um like. She want to get fly when she want to go on dates. She don't even ask for much. You know what I'm saying? It's it's the small things that I feel like have been like <clears throat> cut out. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Dates. Yeah. Flowers. Yeah. Opening the door for Cause you women. got a flower plug. Wait, who who you got a flower fly- oh, plug? Oh, man. You, you, you know what I mean? Who's the flower plug? <laughs> yeah. I got a I got a I got a I got a flower plug. But why you think that um uh, did to, I just did, want women did, did it soft change with era. y'all era though? You know what I'm saying? Because you know, in my era, yeah. I, I opened the door for Queen. That I said, you know what? You know, we we gonna go back to this. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Did it change in, in y'all era to what well, how we're treating women these days? Are we going on dates? Are we giving flowers? Or what are we doing? Um, no, a okay. lot, a lot of a lot of people aren't doing that. A lot of people are not um doing the small basic things that I feel like builds a solid foundation of a healthy. Is that what broke you and Avron up? Oh my God, bro. <laughs> I'm hey, just yo. asking questions. I'm yo. just I'm just here hey, to ask man, the questions. Listen. I'm just here to ask the questions. That's all I'm here for. I ain't. But, was, uh, nah, but nah, that, no, I'm, I'm not, being serious. That's, that's not that's not that's what, not what happened. Okay, good, let's go. no, but, but um, <laughs> yes, go, let's go. Shout out, shout, shout out, shout out, shout shout out, out to Omega man. over there. Shout, shout, shout out, out to Omega, old man. for doing his thing. Yeah. <laughs> shout out to Queen, man. Shout out to my Queen. But um, Look, I want to ask you, did but, uh, I put you in some type of position? Because every time we talk about a run, it's like you kind of get kind of, you know what I'm saying, in your feelings. Like, are you okay? Is everything good? Are you <laughs> hey, are you listen. okay with not being in a relationship with this lady? No, nah, I just want to know. It's um have it been hard for you? Because nah, you haven't nah. had a relationship since, nah, nah, as nah. I know of. Hey, bro, have it been what hard is going for you? On? I'm just asking what the question. What is going on? I'm just, I'm just here to what ask the question. I'm just, oh, are you what okay? is going we on, good? man? No, yo, I'm just asking the yo, question. I'm, I'm good, good, bro. You're in a good space. Life is good, bro. Yeah, I'm it, blessed, good. mental, clear. Did she break up with you or did you break up with her? Hey, Which man, one? It was a... Uh, it was kind of it a mutual co- thing. It was a collective understanding. That's what everybody always say. And that's just how it Nobody was. is taking the loss <laughs> these days. Nobody want to say, I got dumped. You got dumped. See, he should have said, I, I dumped up. So you got dumped. But anyway. Yeah, oh, wait, look yo, at, man, he's crazy, I'm man. just asking the question. He's crazy. That's all I I'm doing. I forgot the question he asked. Hey, that's that's what, what I'm saying. Like, what? No, nah, we're just chilling. Like, we but, just, um, nah, nah, we we just chilling. chilling. We're chilling. But nah, if, if you asking me, am I okay, bro? I'm, <laughs> I'm good. But I mean, you know, when you when you talk about... I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna just keep on honest. Like I said, bro, we on a podcast, bro. We we honest, man. I'm keep on honest. Sipping some water. Subscribe. You feel yeah. me? We keeping it real. I mean, when you when you talk about when you talk about someone that you've had um real deal history with and went through real more than real life shit, it's like notice 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 whenever the topic was brought up, I didn't get mad. I didn't get pissed off. I didn't like, bro. Stop talking about this. I didn't know if you was covering it up. That was, that's what I was nah, nah, man. It's, it's, it's all like, love, bro. It's, it's super, like it's super love. love. You know, but I know. I know. It's super I know. love. You know, you go. It's, it's, gonna... <laughs> it's all love. Hey, man, I'm going to get Rick, man. I'm going to get Rick. I'm going to get Rick. I'm going to get Rick, man. Oh, I told him I got to get Rick. Hey, when these cameras cut off, man, it's going to be me and him, man. I'm trying to tell you. It's going to be me and him. But it's love, though, brother. I know you're coming from a heart. I'm coming from a heartfelt place. Yeah. You know, I just want to know I'm nosy. You know, I'm the media. I got to know what's going on around here. And you I can, and I just, hey, I got to ask questions. Nah. You know, some, that was something my teacher always told me. Hey. When I was a, when I was in middle school, yeah, I was so scared. I was like, you know, I thought I was crazy, but I didn't ever want to ask a question. And my teacher told me, no question is a dumb question it's if you don't know question. it. So everything I'm asking you, it ain't done. And I, and I, I just want to know. Respect it. Cause I respect it. I need it. to know. When I need to, if you I'm must on stage, have, I need to tell them, I need to be like, Lotus Dump Adriano. I need nah, to know what's nah, going You know what I'm saying? Nah, I need to know what's going on. You must, you, you must. <laughs> no, no. No, and I'm saying this in a good way. I'm saying this in a good way, but you, 
You must want to see us together or something, man. I sure do. That's, just, 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 just go. I'm just come out and it. say it. I'm throwing it out there. Just I'm come out and say it. I threw the bait out there. You know what I'm saying? I'm throwing it out there. Two, two celebrities together. I love to see that shit. I can see Beyonce and Jay Z. I can see it. Powerful. You know what I'm saying? Powerful. So get yeah, <laughs> Solid. Hey, Solid. I'm finna get him up out of here, Solid. You, I know Solid ready to go. We ain't up get him. But look, look. This is what I wanna. Um, I wanna ask you to do because um, I wanna ask you to. Give our people something. Oh, when this come out, this is going to be crazy. Because look, because this is the thing. I want to bring up something. Shit. Uh, we talking about the kids downtown and, you know, with the the white supremacists and stuff. Yeah, crazy. And they call them nigglets and all this stuff. And, like, we are trying to come together, but we can't come together for one day. Right. So how can we come together and be, like, a real unit? <clears throat> Man. comes down to support i feel like it comes down to support and it comes down to people genuinely i'm always saying the word genuinely because yeah. it has to like, come like from like a, it has like to it. come from a genuine space I like, like it can't be something that yeah. just has to be done because we feel it needs to be done it has to be so people have to want to see the change you know yeah. what i'm saying but i feel like if we all as a collective come on the same page like bro we are so powerful as Ooh. a unit i feel like there's there's nothing there's no, there's no reason why nobody can make it out put it like this we if the city pops out for what they can pop out to and it's coming from a genuine space like oh man i oh man i know i know los got an event over there man i'm gonna stop over there yeah i mean i know miss delicia got an event over there man i'm gonna go stop over at delicia thing if it if we know that oh okay um black rob got this or dj crisis got this and we all make it our business to pop out and support in the and and everything is reciprocated on every end, but there's no reason why we can't. Because it's power in numbers, bro. Oh. You know how many people in Nashville? You know how many black people in Nashville? You know how many people, collective social medias we all have as a collective? How much reach that is? Just if yeah. you share your another fellow artist or you share his flyer or he does this or he does that, bro, it's the opportunities are Endless, Facts. but it has to come from a genuine Play. space. No, you couldn't. You, you feel you me? Couldn't, you couldn't say it no better than that. It yeah. really has to come from a genuine space. I want to see everybody win, bro. Oh man, everybody. I ain't even like, I feel like we all got our own lane. And yeah, if 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 if, if Lotus win, I feel like this. Is how I feel if Lotus win, I win. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because I'm connected through you. Yeah. And through you, like even when it, um, I don't like to talk to y'all artists. Uh, on in a good way, I like to go through managers. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm that type of like yeah. person. Like I like to, I, and I respect the fact. I that like you, it to be like that. Yeah. It should be like this. Like chain, I should be able to command. I should be able to have to go through him to get to you. Mm-hmm. Like that's just a that's just a setup for success. Like I shouldn't be able to get to Lotus. Mm-hmm. To be honest, not me, but I'm just saying anybody else per se. So when me and Solid, we was just like, I was just like let's do it. Like. We would yeah. do this day. We set it up. He got, you know what I mean? And so um, I respect you. That's I right. respect you on a that's level cool. of that's how I think it should be. You know yeah. what I mean? Like you are one of the artists. Mm-hmm. Like you ain't going to never real. hear that's me real. come on my podcast and brag on somebody that I don't really believe in. You know right. what I mean? That just ain't me. I ain't going to never do it because I'm too honest with myself. And so, um, man, appreciate you for coming over here. Uh, where we Where we go from here? Like, you know, they had to start the concert, but mm-hmm. and Kwani and all them come out of everything. Yeah. It, it was cool. Well, I, I, I quote unquote, it's cool. So where do we go from here? Um, Elaborate. El- elaborate. Elaborate on that question one more time. Um, when you say where do we, we go from here? Like, we, oh, okay. As far as what? As far as artists? As far as the, the city? The like, entertainment community. Yeah. If we trying to come together and we trying to make it, um, and we are saying that we are, together where do we go from here like what's the next move what we need to be doing to make sure that we stay connected and make it to where everybody got to go especially the people that's Mm. actually talented like you man i feel like for one um we need to have more we need to have more events man okay we need to have more events that artists can come out and actually network and actually get to know each other yeah you know what i'm saying because it'd be so much on some like Man, you actually get you actually sit down and get to know someone. You be like, man, dude is a dude is a genuine dude. Dude exactly. is a real good dude. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And I feel like we need a we all need to develop that relationship with you. Now, now you don't got now you don't gotta 
necessarily be up somebody ass. You ain't got to do. You ain't got to do that. none of that. Yeah. But you can come to a common ground and be like, Nah, I respect this person. I respect right. this person, and I feel like we all just need to come together, and as a collective, bro, just actually want to see the change. Actually, yeah. actually want to see everyone win. Do more events. Yeah. More people. Yeah. Like man, somebody throw this. Somebody throw this. Everybody go. Yeah, facts, facts. Everybody facts, go. Facts, facts. And you're going to see everybody that you know, everybody needs to be following each other. Everybody needs to be subscribed to each other's this, do that. Like, everybody needs to be like, commenting, and sharing. That's the only way we're going to be able to come together and actually win, Before bro. Before we go, let me ask you a question. Ain't nothing wrong with that let neither. Me, I want to ask you this question because I be so like, I'm so yeah. caught up on this right here. Yeah. Um, we You got a lot of artists, you know, and I'm talking about Nashville. I always talk about Nashville because I'm from here. Absolutely. So I ain't talking about no other city. That's like, all we talking we, about. You know, I'm on my, when I'm on my media stuff, yeah, I'm yeah. talking about Atlanta and all this stuff. But I'm talking about uh, Nashville as a collective. Why when my posts come across certain people page, they act like they don't see it? You, you, you know what, me and you commenting on each other all the time. We like each other. All the time. Like, I know they, you know, you know certain people seeing it. So what's the whole back of this person saying, hey, Lotus, do a good job? What you think? Like, what's the problem? Do you think it's, like they don't want to see you or hey, they, you want me to want me, you want me to give you the real answer? I want I want the real answer. I give you the real answer. See, unfortunately, due to the fact that I feel like we haven't been necessarily educated and taught to show love. Uh-huh. Ooh. I feel like that hasn't been passed down. Ooh. You know, because sometimes we we didn't see some of our OGs support each other. We didn't see our OGs post each other we didn't see some of the people that okay, we, we didn't see we we didn't see we, we didn't see it yeah so yeah. i feel like that's a that's a passed on trait Ooh. it's passed on and i feel like you know sometimes people are afraid to show love to you publicly because Ooh. what they've said or what they might have or the actions behind privately your back, they can't might make them look like Oh, no, nah, you ain't 100 because you yeah. know for a fact that there's just the other day you were saying how you ain't yeah. feel like little bro was this. <laughs> yeah. And now I see you under his comments saying this. Woo. That's a judgment of your character. So sometimes, man, it be like they might have they might have said something about you privately, so they don't want to show love publicly. But when they see you, it be like what I said, all I get is we going to work and I see you. So that shit on repeat. You feel me? Yeah, yeah, See how I just brought all that together? Because that's the truth. Mm. But but you know what? Since you a genuine guy, okay, and I'm a genuine guy, most definitely. When I see your post, I'm gonna like it. I'm gonna comment. I'm gonna share it. If if, if you because it don't take me no money to do that. That's why. See, look. That's why I say like, uh, me it's free. I'm not stingy with my platform at all. You be? But I know my platform is like of real of a caliber right. and so you can be the biggest artist that you think you are but i don't care about that you know what i mean and no. so and and even i ain't doing you a favor about bringing you on my podcast you got you got push you got you you you, you got motion i appreciate but, um but why i really wanted you here yeah because the way you supported me because you understand the shares and the comments mm -hmm. if if i'm posting a post and it's good you know, everybody ain't gonna comment us on everything, but I'm posting and post if it's good. I can guarantee Sweet Poison, Lotus, Kwani, Bree, I can guarantee they gonna they gonna comment, they gonna share it. They yeah. gonna say, hey P you and I and because I respect it's, that. It's free, bro. Yeah. That's what I'm yeah. saying. Like you act like people act like just People act like it's gonna take some money out, out, out of my out of my Chase account or whoever you bank with just to, to share your music, ooh, to share your post. Facts. That ain't gonna take none out of my account, bro. Instagram is free. Yeah, that's free promotion. TikTok is free. Unless Facebook is free. You feel me? So it's just like a lot of people. A lot of people don't really. A lot of people don't understand. It's like, man, it's like utilize, utilize this, utilize this this platform that we have to yeah. to to get each other out. You know what I'm saying? And, and I want to say this because, you know, our people ain't educated like that. When, when you like our stuff, when you comment on, on our stuff, it helps the algorithm and it helps them deliver it to other people. Yeah. And so if we in Nashville, if everybody, and this is just something for Nashville so they know, right. if we in Nashville and everybody go online and say, Lotus is dope, 
like you really want to say or share it and all that, mm-hmm. that helps us get out there more to people that don't follow us. Mm-hmm. And so and so a lot of times our people ain't educated, but some people know. So I have to hold the people accountable. If you in this entertainment business, you know what it takes for me to get out there. And so I'm just holding them accountable. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, you feel me? That's just that's just what it is, man. And like I said, no matter what history I have with anyone, no matter what I've been through with anyone, I still genuinely want to see you win. It's love. You know what I'm saying? Regardless. We gonna end on that. Um, yeah, we want to see you win. Thank you. Uh, some people we don't care if you win or not. We don't care if you win, lose, or draw. You know what I mean? Right. Because uh, we we are on some godly type of shit. Yes, sir. Like anybody know if you're last subscribed, <laughs> like we got first. You know what I'm saying? And Absolutely. So some of y'all we don't want to see y'all win because y'all evil, and y'all gonna take y'all win and try to stump on the righteous people heads, you know what I'm saying? So we don't want it. We, we want every righteous person to win. And so that's just what it is. Um, God if you're a live subscriber, people, man. man, this been a uh, solid over here. Queen over here. We got out of time. What, what's your name? We got Woods in this bitch. Hey, listen. Lotus Mercy anywhere. Listen, listen, listen. Look, once again, man, I appreciate you bringing me on the podcast, man. I'm, I'm a, I'm a fan first. I'm a fan first. I, I've been, I've really been, um, antsy to get on here but like every time i see you you always say it's timing but i got this ep called give me my flowers man it's a r&b trap soul tape feel good music for the ladies to enjoy have fun turn up to feel good music I for the players you too i'm gonna tell you what i'm jealous about listen before to. we go what's up i was jealous you gave miss princess them damn flowers i, I was i want i wanted to do something like it you know what i mean yeah. Miss princess she's a staple no nah, i want to um i want to yeah. commend you on that or uh, she has been deserving her flowers for forever. Man, so bro. for you to be the one, uh, my little homie, like all these, I be trying to tell people like, oh, Lotus Breed, them all my people, like nigga, yeah. them, them my, like I'll do anything for them. That's love, but like bro. when I saw you give them flowers, like damn, I like that. You know what I'm saying? That because, was a, because that was you a know, good moment. And, and we and we we gonna we gonna end. We're going to yeah. end it probably about two minutes. We got two minutes. We got two minutes. Let me two minutes. Yo, you know the mean? people that deserve their flowers. We'll receive them. Okay. Lotus Music gonna make sure of that. You feel me? I'm gonna keep it real. I should have walked in this mall with a bouquet for you, but I got something for you though. I got some merch for you. You feel me? I got you. I got you a Lotus Music put the work in shirt. I like. I you know like what I'm this. saying? I got something for you, but I like it. I'm gonna I'm I'm say this, man. Um, that's that's really that's really what the EP is based off of, man. It's just feel good music. It's music for people to um, like I said. Vibe to, listen to, late night rides. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Give the people that are deserving of their flowers. I, I, somebody told me that I made the perfect side nigga album, and that <laughs> I was like, I was like, well, I didn't, I didn't Your make the nigga. project <laughs> saying that I was a side <laughs> nigga, but I mean, you can definitely do some lovable things to my album. You feel me? So, um, but yeah, man, I, I just the people, the people that are deserving their flowers will definitely receive them, man. And and I feel like it's a lot of people in Nashville that have set the set the tone that have yeah. broke ground you know like when you break ground on a, on a new place that you i feel like it's a lot of people that built a solid foundation that haven't received their flowers from their peers Thanks. and these are a lot of people that i grew up to that i grew up listening to grew up watching you know what i'm saying that they're going to definitely receive them so you know what i'm saying just give me my flowers out right now on all streaming platforms you can follow me on instagram Anywhere, streaming, social, man, L-O-T-I-S, Emmy West I-C. Make sure you tapping in with the music, man. And I'm going to be doing more content, be doing more vlogs so people can definitely get in tune with who Lotus Music, man, who Lotus Music is. Shout out to the team. Shout out to the company, Double Solid. You know, shout out to everybody that's playing a part in the development of Lotus Music. And I'm very grateful for you. I'm very grateful for anyone out here in Nashville, Tennessee, that is providing a platform for people to showcase their talent, man. I love what everyone's doing. Yeah. I love how everyone's moving. And if you alive, subscribe, man. Hey, look here. You feel me? You don't get no SCA awards if you ain't a major player. Shout out Rio. You know what I'm saying? You I'm feel a me? motherfucking major player, goddamn yeah. it. Shout out, goddamn Rio. Shout out uh infamous. Yeah. And if if you alive, subscribe. That's how we doing it.